Hey everybody, what is going on? I hope you guys are all doing well and welcome to another tutorial video. In this video, I'm going to be explaining to you guys how you can transfer ownership of your Wix site to another person. So let's get right into it or not rather to another person, but to another account. It could be another person or it could be another one of your accounts. It doesn't matter. But yeah, let's get right into it. What you need to do first is go to your site's dashboard. As you can see, I am currently at the dashboard for one of my sites and you want to go to the home page here at the left panel. Once you're here, as you can see, this is what it looks like. You need to go into the top right and click these three dots, which are the site actions next to the design site button. And you'll get this menu. As you can see, one of the options is transfer site. And we're going to be clicking on that. And as you can see, this pop up appears. Now here you can enter an email address manually, or you can pop down the menu. If you already have a couple of people that you've corresponded with on Wix, you can just drop this down and select a person from there. Uh, or if you're connected with other accounts, you can do that as well. But usually you will need to add a manual email. And once you add that, you'll just click the continue button, which at this current moment is grayed out for my account because I didn't enter an email address. I'll just add some random email address, for example, tutorial uh, at gmail.com. And as you can see, you need to describe them first, either as a client, an agency or freelancer or someone else. I'll click someone else and then click continue. And as you can see, you can keep your role as a co-owner or you can create a copy of the site and keep it in your account if you want to. You can check off either option if you want to. I'll just do this and then click. Actually, I'll just create a copy and just transfer the ownership and then transfer ownership again. And as you can see, the transfer invite has been set and they have to respond to it and accept it. If they don't, the transfer won't go through, but that is pretty much all you need to do. As you can see, it's creating a copy right now and it has created one successfully. And that's pretty much it. Hope you guys enjoyed. I'll be seeing you guys in another video.